assalamu alaikum students hope you all are fine inshallah i am your grade 8 pakistan studies teacher today we are going to learn something very important in fact it's the core of pakistan studies your first chapter name is ideological basis of pakistan it means nazariya uh, pakistan ki buniyad first we have to know what is the word ideology so it's the french word an ideology is a set of opinion or beliefs of a group or an individual many ideologies mention as a set of political belief or set of ideas that describe a particular culture it's like when you wanted to do something good so first you get a thought of doing that good work like you wanted to help your friend in hard times but why you wanted to help him because your thinking is that when you help others allah subhanahu wa taala will count it as a big virtue and allah subhanahu wa taala will make your life peaceful and happier so your this thinking is your ideology now we get it that every work has been done by a particular ideology or mindset now come to slide number 4 sources of islamic ideology it's like what are the main factors of islamic ideology it's very clear that the sources of ideology is firstly our holy book quran second is sunna and third is tradition and culture and you know it's very well that our islamic celebrations are eid al azha and eid al fitr and islamic culture the way we live our life within islam slide number 5 is about content of ideology so there are four contents of ideology common culture common cause common religion and dedication here are the four contents which strengthen the ideology and as you know that when we have a strong ideology we will never give up in any difficult time or crisis we will never become hopeless because we are focused with our national ideology and we always look forward for the bright future as i have mentioned the bullet points here common culture has sharing same culture same way of life don't compromise on their customs second is common cause unites people and common ideology third is common religion binding force for a nation and distinctive nation fourth is dedication people have same noble cause which enriches the ideology making a developed country slide number 6 basis of ideology of pakistan the basis of ideology of pakistan is islam the main elements of islam ideology are doctrine of faith and social dealings doctrine of faith unicity of allah prophethood of last prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam belief in angels belief in judgment day belief in all revealed books the second part the second point is social system the mutual dealings in social system respectable position in social system justice and equality in social system and there is no discrimination ethnicity caste color and creed these are the basis of ideology of pakistan which makes us a distinctive or unique nation both parts comprise the deen and the universal humanity rules slide number 7 principles of democracy in islam to run a islamic go- democratic government within these rules it's like the rules of khilafat e rashida means the principles which had practiced in initial period of islam in arab justice equality fraternity and tolerance these are the main four pillars of islamic government if we lose one pillar so the whole structure of the islamic democracy will fall off i'm mentioning the bullet points of justice our foundation of divine law 
prosperous society quran teachings protected individual rights second is equality islam rejects discrimination race language caste wealth precedence on basis of self restraint and islamic sharia third one is fraternity means brotherhood brotherhood in islam society becomes a peaceful a migration to medina is the best example of the brotherhood the last point is tolerance tolerance is a great virtue promote love for others avoiding conflict develop social relation peace and stability in society slide number 8 ideology and national character there are six elements which shapes character of the nation firm belief in the ideology commitment honesty patriotism hard work and national interest in firm belief development of muslim character it developed the muslim character it revives the national spirit in citizens or nation it builds islamic values and character second point is commitment it builds the sense of duty and responsibility in a person character reflects highest virtue third point is honesty islam emphasizes upon honesty it should in all fields of life it should be in all fields of life patriotism hard working and uh, patriotism and inter- an eternal virtue love and sacrifice for nation hard work national progress individual hard working and requires sense of duty last one national interest national interest with no compromise very important for nation everything should be very important for the nation slide number 9 worksheet number 1 answer the following questions question number 1 what are the sources of islamic ideology write briefly question number 2 what are the basis of the islamic ideology write briefly and the last question is what are the main characteristics of national character write three points briefly thank you